Looks like they removed one of my videos. Not gonna say a specific name. <laughs> YouTube. <laughs> but, uh, somebody. They removed my video that I did a week or, or I don't, actually I did it a, when the uh, scripted attempt <laughs> uh, whenever that first happened I did a video saying hey this uh, event like so many others is scripted and so I did the video and uh, at some point it got removed and only saw it recently because it had been a while since I did any other videos or started streaming again. So yeah, I just found out recently, but it was in like July or some shit. They removed it under hate speech and whatever other bullshit babble they had to say in the fucking email. Either way, it's bullshit. Like, how is it hate speech to say that something was scripted? I mean, even if it was hate speech, people need to understand, including you, uh, pagan Rand YouTube. Uh, you need to understand it's not that fucking serious. Um, yeah, when it comes to freedom of speech, that means freedom of speech, even if you don't like it. Even if you call it hate speech, freedom of speech trumps, get it, your bullshit hate speech routine. It ain't gonna be working for too much longer, so enjoy it while you can, Satan and Satan's loser children. It's fucked up, because... I know I can go online, and I already have. See plenty of people saying the same shit with a whole lot of subscribers. They're not getting their shit removed. And I'm not saying that as a complaint. I'm actually saying that as like a um, proud badge of honor kind of thing. Because it goes to show like... For the people that are allowed to say whatever they say, even if it is about truth, and nobody fucks with them like YouTube or Satan in any way, it means that they're more on the devil's side than they even think. As opposed to those of us that are absolutely with God, here to remind Satan she's a bitch. Kick the bitch in her pussy. Alright, reminder that she lost over 2,000 years ago. Uh, we're the ones that know what we're fucking doing. And the devil knows that. The devil knows that I'm one of the devil's biggest threats on this fucking planet. Which is why the devil has to go through so much to keep me from being where I'm supposed to be. To do what I'm here to do. Because of shit like this, the devil is shook of me so much that someone with one subscriber, and by the way, I preferred having no subscribers at all, but thank you to the person who did. Uh, but I have one subscriber, and YouTube is that worried about me? Apparently a nobody with no subscribers, but one. So you're that threatened by me that you removed my video saying that the attempt was scripted? Thanks. Thank you, pagan worshippers that work for YouTube. And thank you, Satan, for whispering in these dumb shit's ears to uh, remove my video. All you are doing, Satan, you stupid bitch, is giving me more credibility along with the other me's that you've been keeping at bay for years. The jig is up, bitch. 
When you use all your fucking shit, you've got nothing left to use. And then there'll be lost nothing left but God shitting all over you through us. His chosen ones, the ones you hate more than everybody else. All good for you, Satan. You just blessed me by father. And you're blessing a whole lot of other people by doing your bullshit against chosen ones. The last ones you want to fuck with. And you know this, but you're too stupid to understand whatever. Bottom line, I take it as a badge of honor. Uh, it, it said that it was a warning, and that next time I commit some sort of problem or whatever, that uh, then it would be another strike or some shit, and then I couldn't uh, stream for a week or upload a video for a week. Oh no, YouTube, don't punish me like that, considering I'm rarely even doing this shit, you dumb fucks. God bless you, though. God bless you, may God have mercy on your souls for listening to Satan's bitch ass. But it's okay, you're just doing your job as a minion of Satan. And like I said, it's all good because this YouTube channel of mine, this is all for future credibility purposes, and this is one of them. Remove my videos. Cool. Because when everybody understands that there is a difference between real main characters and all the NPCs pretending to be, it's going to be understood that there's forms of measurement to be able to tell the difference. And one of those differences is if YouTube's not having a problem with you, it's because you are YouTube. And I mean that in the pagan YouTube perspective. Like clearly they don't mind you because they're not threatened by you. Therefore they have no problem you saying whatever you want even if it's truth against Satan, they know you're not gonna get the same amount of backing as those of us that actually know what we're talking about ourselves. Not just because we heard other main characters saying shit and then jotting it down and repeating it like parrots, which is what all of the majority people Either way, this will be credibility, so remove my videos. In the future, it'll be proof that I am the real thing, not an imitator like everybody else who seems to be left alone. It's because they're not actual main characters. Satan isn't threatened by NPCs, which is the majority of people. Satan is threatened by the main characters because the main characters are here doing what we were born to do. Unlike all the rest of you that sold that out and chose to be an NPC instead of the main character you were born to be. So yeah. Remove my shit. It's credibility. Delete my channel at some point. That'll be credibility. Because I'll just make another channel. And another channel. And then it doesn't matter. I am not on here for subscribers. I am not here to serve Satan. So fuck Satan's algorithms. None of that matter, you can't hurt God's people with this petty NPC shit. That hurts the NPCs, it doesn't hurt us, it's like the 4B movement shit. You're not hurting us. Have at it, you dumb motherfuckers. And I mean Satan and Satan's children, you are some dumb motherfuckers. Everything you do 
causes the opposite effect. So yeah, fuck with me. Cool. That's expected. I came into this knowing at some point YouTube was gonna come after me. Duh, I'm here to speak truth for God. Of course, Satan's gonna have a problem with me being here. Satan runs YouTube. I'm here to represent YouTube when it first started. God gave everybody YouTube. And then Satan bought it within a few fucking years. And hoarded it out. Like Satan does with everything. God gives us something great. Something dope. Something we all can love and appreciate. And the devil comes along at some point to fuck it all up. So here we are. YouTube. Shit. Because Satan runs it. But I'm here to represent God's YouTube. The YouTube God first gave us. Which was, you do your thing, you record it, you upload it. The end. What the fuck is this? Subscribers, hit the like button, hit the no Shut the fuck up. That's not what YouTube was when it was pure and innocent and a beautiful fucking thing. Until Satan came along and pissed and shit all over it. So I'm not going by these uh, terms of services that were amendments to an original fucking thing that God put here. And so the rules of when first YouTube came is God's rules, which means Satan, shut your fucking mouth, you cunt. You have no say over God. You can try all you want, but you'll have to deal with the repercussions of God directly dealing with each and every one of you that listens to Satan and does what Satan wants you to do. Delete this guy's YouTube. Delete his video. That's Satan talking. That's hate speech. That's Satan talking. God's not telling anybody you can say whatever you want except for he hate speech. The fuck you. God allows us to say and think and feel whatever we want, whether it's right or wrong. God never forces us to do otherwise. Who the fuck are you, YouTube? Satan. You don't get to force us to do or not do something if God doesn't. Fuck all of you. Worship this cunt-ass Lucy. Satan, whatever you want to call the dumb bitch-ass devil. Anywho, like I said, this is credibility. So thank you, YouTube, you pagan worshiping shits that uh, listen to Satan and don't actually listen to God. Because God doesn't force people to do anything, even if you don't like it. Um, but yeah, good luck with all that, uh, cause you're fucking with God, you're not fucking with me. Just like David said to Goliath, or, or in this case, David said to YouTube, it's not me that you're fighting against. It is God in me that you are fighting against, which is why you lost already. So keep it up, you two pagan faggots that work there. Keep it up. Take this fucking video off too. God, let's strike my channel as much as we can so I can make a new channel. Start all over. Upload all the shit I saved anyway. It'll make my next channel even more successful. It'll make me look more professional because everything will be there already. I'll be able to upload daily shit that I did forever ago and what of it. New channel, good. Ain't hurt nobody. Gonna just keep re-uploading. <clears throat>
repeat whatever I've said already and keep repeating and say whatever I want after the fact. You can't stop me, Satan, because you can't stop God, and God is in me. Go fuck yourself. You lost over 2,000 years ago, and you keep losing even when you think you're winning, you stupid fuck. As I was saying, uh, so yeah, they removed my video talking about the uh, scripted attempt on someone's life. We know what I'm talking about, alright? Uh, yeah, what of it? Still saying it, and I'm gonna keep saying it because it's true. All these events scripted. It's all a script. Alright, just like you guys deleting a video, me or anybody, that's part of the script. You dumb shits. Because there is a real script going on, not the NWO script, which does happen, but the real script that matters is the script of God's play. That's the script that matters. Fuck the Satan script. But the script is still happening. And all these little events are scripted. Your sports entertainment is sports entertainment for a reason. Because it's entertainment. It's fake. It's scripted. Just like wrestling. They're physically doing things. Cool. Wonderful. Congratulations. But who is going to win and who is going to lose is scripted. The point spread is scripted. So you guys just love this scripted shit and take it for real. Like it's serious sports like it used to be. You can fucking break. Anyway, it's all scripted. Stop getting mad at us for speaking the truth and being able to handle that truth. Uh, and YouTube, you know, those of you that are for Satan and work for YouTube, go fuck yourself. God bless you. In spirit, I'm saying God bless you with sincerity. But in the flesh, go fuck yourselves. You guys are not going to get what you think you are going to get out of this. You can't fuck with the chosen ones and act like God himself is not going to deal with you directly. So good luck with that. Either way, I just wanted it for the record that I didn't remove my video and I wouldn't ever remove any of my videos. Because I don't believe in that bullshit. Like whatever I've said, I said, here you go, cool. And I'm not retracting shit like all these fucking sellouts and they're gonna be doing apology videos like these sellout faggots with millions of subscribers. Fuck out of here. Either way, this is a win for me. Even though, uh, a lot of people would think it's a loss. No, it's a good thing. Because like I said, my YouTube channel is for future credibility. Because again, when everybody finally does understand the rules of shit and how to differentiate between the real motherfuckers and the imitators, it's going to be understood that this shit matters. Like, oh, this guy, he's got this many videos that were removed from YouTube. He has this many channels that were deleted by YouTube. So clearly he's one of the real ones because YouTube doesn't care about the imitators. YouTube doesn't bother them because they're not a threat. Because they're not real main characters. And so people are going to know that. 
Because people are going to be like, so how are we supposed to tell the difference between a real main character and an NPC pretending to be a main character? Well, these are one of those forms of measurement. If you don't get fucked with by the government, your pagan government, if you're not getting fucked with by police, pagan police, if you're not getting fucked with by corporate America, if you're not getting fucked with by pagan ran YouTube, it means you're on NPC devil dark side side of your fucking team. You're on the devil's team, whether you know it or not. That's why Satan doesn't worry about you. That's why you're not a threat to Satan. Because in some part of your life, you're doing, saying, feeling, and thinking exactly what Satan wants you to do. So therefore, Satan has no one to fuck with in you. Because you're already on her side. If the devil isn't there to oppose you, it means you're probably going in the same direction as the devil. So for people who do get fucked with by Satan, it'll be understood it's because we're a threat to Satan. Satan really doesn't want us around. Satan really doesn't want us talking to any of you. Because Satan knows we're the real things, and we're the ones that can get you to straighten the fuck out, finally. And Satan doesn't want that. So yeah, it's credibility. And in the future, it will be understood. Because when all these imitators of me, and the imitators of me's, finally start being looked at differently. It's gonna be understood YouTube's not removing their videos. YouTube's not deleting their channels. The government's not trying to get in their fucking way. It's because they're not really against Satan. You just think they are because they pretend they're not. But it's going to be understood that there's imitators, and then there's the real thing. So again, thank you, Satan Ran YouTube, for removing my video and giving me credibility. Because if I wasn't a threat to Satan, you'd have no reason to worry about me whatsoever, no matter what I said. Right or wrong, you should not care that much about me. I have one subscriber. I don't do this every fucking day. I am not here for subscribers. I'm not here for money and fame. What do you got against me? That I speak truth. And you call it hate speech. All right. Good luck with that Satan. I mean, uh, pagan worshipping uh, YouTube people that fucking work for him, her, work for YouTube. You guys are pagans, but God bless you anyway, and I'll pray for you. Because clearly you need God more than everybody else, if you're listening to Satan that much. Anywho, till next time. God is good. God is great. God is wonderful. Fuck Satan. She's a bitch. And Jesus Christ is the man.